okay so now we will move to the uh, this blog okay, especially we will take it out this topic the first of our sentiment analysis we'll give it here okay and uh, we just uh, you know say control b we just run this stuff and check that our code is perfect we don't have any error we don't have any issues and if it gives a plot then we are good to go okay so here we are getting some error so as we are asking for the sentiment for article okay it is uh, the text block which i am talking about should be article here okay not the news i mean we definitely uh, utilize this uh, in our uh, news only okay so we will try to loop it okay so that's the reason it should be article not the news okay so we definitely got certain things and uh, i think there is no comparison okay so that's the reason also it is not giving any kind of a uh, the things which i'm looking for okay so we'll try to add one more thing and we'll see so pld definitely it is there i have given the length of the news and then i'm giving the sentiment so I think yeah, best is there. So we'll take it one more thing here. Okay. So maybe I've given the comma, so that is also the reason. I'll try to take it out and see. Okay. So let's add uh, one more topic and we can see what we got here. So at least it's it, could have given here uh, but I think something I am missing here okay, so let's see this uh, we will give it one more uh, headings or news for it to feed okay so all of this list uh, you know you can fit it as a CSV okay, text so that is up to you how you want to feed Should be in a single comment. Okay. And let's run this stuff. Okay. So as you can see, I think I got certain things, okay. And uh, if I am taking this as uh, the main of the graph, okay, something which I believe I'm missing. Okay, so that is the reason also the first thing has been not taken properly. Okay, but I think it is going step by step. So we can include at first thing, to compare at certain things, the range length at least one length I got okay and uh, we'll like you know print this polarity as well okay so if I'm getting this news what I what I can do I can check the sentiment as well okay so what is the reason that at first we didn't get anything so it is also we can check let's see so at least some print statement should be there so it is it is giving a neutral value okay so we need to understand so that is the reason okay so at first maybe it is just a post okay so if it is gets to the, the blog okay if, if it is not giving any kind of emotion or sentiment 
if we different in a neutral okay so there's a reason also we are not getting that value okay so it is the best way at least to, to understand how things are getting did okay and then next what we are getting we are getting some positive it is 0.3 okay and now next we will deal with another uh, this uh, news okay so we will compare with a third one we will go with these things and we will add this stuff okay so we will give it here and we will give it in a single comment So I believe I got this, but I've closed earlier. So I need to close it here. Okay. So this is how we can give. Okay. And we will see uh, this plot. I mean, what is the visualization of this plot? So we got the negative, uh, the value. The first is, uh, I mean, the impact which we got is like minus 0 0.18. Okay, so at the starting, it was like, you know, some kind of a positive impact and definitely we got a negative impact. So this is how uh, for the third post, I mean, third block of that post is this way. Is this is a polarity. Okay. And the next we'll check with another polarity. So that is that is you can say that is the impact of news especially this news kind of a you know holds uh, the sentiment as a negative only for the markets okay not the positive and in between uh, the post which is uh, you know we are just analyzing a writer's perspective okay so that's what we are doing here And we will see the another post. Okay. So I believe this is what we got. So another post, I believe whatever I have given, I uh, have 0, 0.0. I mean the post uh, which I am talking about as I am giving, uh, you know, step by step. Okay. And uh, this need to be kind of uh, as we done, done it earlier. So this is not giving any kind of a uh, positive, negative kind of a comment okay especially if i believe if i get to any of uh, the under news okay maybe i'll get the details okay so this is how i'm going okay so one more thing which i'll do it and then i'll go with another uh, under news okay, and we will check that uh, sentiment okay so that is how you can do next thing is and we will give it so as you can see uh, uh, we don't have to do anything with the news okay whatever it is there uh, we are just trying to get its uh, sentiments okay If we do it through a uh, web scrapping method, I think uh, this manual stuff will be get easy. Otherwise, uh, if you want to like, you know, a shorter new sentiment analysis, if you want to do this will be better. So let's see this, what kind of things will give. Okay, so I think this is has some uh, polarity type, okay, some positive. Okay, so this is how uh, the news is getting at first. It was neutral. Then we got some uh, positive then uh, back to the negative okay so this is how the sentiment this is neutral and then positive okay so that's we are doing and what is what is the impact of uh, that news will be there so zero 
1 and minus 1. So like that it is going the polarity. Even if you check in my machine learning part, okay, so I have talked about matrix, matrix. So all of the matrix here, we are taking some like, you know, scale to match or uh, to check these things. Okay, so that is how you can do. Now we will try to take it out uh, each and everything. And uh, we will like, you know, see this stuff. Uh, we will like, you know, uh, we will try to take it out and we'll give it as uh, the under news I mean what kind of a polarity we will receive so in this at least what happens these uh, you are uh, maybe whatever given the headline post okay contains uh, mostly like you know neutral but uh, in this scenario suppose any news is there what happens it will definitely gonna get give you uh, a maximum polarity okay so if i print okay so this is what you can see a news impact so this is how the analysis is done okay in the next part what we have to do uh, we try to take it one more thing and we will say the comparison is must so So this is how uh, the first statement was like, you know, uh, giving a mostly uh, positive uh, kind of a polarity and then suddenly it was like, you know, uh, a dip in that news. Okay. And uh, this is how you can do some of like, you know, earlier uh, comparison where uh, they have been given certain kind of news or blocks. Okay. So you can understand the sentiment at first and then in the second and what impact that will create okay so that you can understand from this sentiment analysis this is the approach where you can find it out for uh, any of news which is coming okay uh, that you can analyze okay and uh, take decisions in the market whether what do you really want to do okay if the data uh, of the financial sentiment analysis is showing very much uh, like you know favoring in that block part which is really negative okay comparing to the previous block okay then definitely we can see uh, like you know downwards a uh, movement okay so uh, whether whatever the news impact will be there either it will get neutralized other uh, otherwise it will take it as a positive and move up otherwise it will get in the negative okay so that is how the impact of a news or market will be there okay so i must say uh, you know do check it out i will definitely give the code link in the description okay thanks for watching please do like share and subscribe if you have any doubt regarding this video, please do comment below. If you have any other queries or requirements, please do contact me directly by WhatsApp. Thank you.